Hello there, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another episode here in Past Years. Good to have you. Pleasure to have you. Thank you very much for joining us today. We're actually going to be playing the Aquatic Adventure of the Last Human from Digirati Distribution. And yes, the last adventure, uh, Aquatic Adventure of the Last Human feels very much like a kind of like uh, Abzu slash Echo the Dolphin S game from what I've actually seen of the materials. So hopefully, um, I, I don't get too emotionally involved, but uh, we're going to give this just a good old solid college try, you know? Let's going to give it a look. We're going to see how it goes. I can see the fish. That's what they want. Um, 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 um. Alright, all sentence, good and grand. We are going to jump straight into this. The year 2972. As the Earth slowly moves through its orbit, and a ship leaves, flying into the great cosmic dust cloud. As he flies into the black hole! The time continues to pass. It is now 2984. 85. 86, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh my god! Time is long lost! And then beyond time, the ship returns, obviously losing his home planet. What will he find upon his return? At the beginning of a new ice age, man returns to Earth with a sudden thwack. <laughs> okay, uh, immediately crash into the water and be like, I'm a sub now! And this is where all the things were! Wow. I actually like this. This is very calming. Hey, big fishies! Hey, big fishy! I like you! I like you! Do I like you? You're a disco ball! What the, what the hell is that? Hollow tip. Press the crossbow. Yes. I am pressing the cross button. I, oh, wait. <laughs> base 702, 3016 This base will be our new frontier for interstellar missions. Press the cross button to close. Well, shit. <laughs> we continue our explorations. And it seems to have zoomed in quite a lot. Alright, these are doors I can't pass. Are you following me? Ari, we want to go back home. The floodgate will remain closed until the water level is sterilized. Base 702 will be your home for now. Okay. Okay. So the water has been sterilized, so there seems to be some kind of disease. What the fuck are those? Morning! More and more reports are coming in that gigantic clams are destroying our worker drones. Be cautious out there, workers. Drones. Beware of sewage pipe leaps. Corrosive sewage will greatly damage the hull of all work shuttles. Avoid contact from your own safety. Press the cross button to close. Yay. Um. North? North? What the fuck? Harpoon acquired! Fire harpoon with the R2 button. Press and hold to charge. The longer you charge, the further harpoon will travel. Good for damaging hostile underwater creatures can also be used as use the press buttons. Yay! Oh no 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 
So you only got a boss to fight. Oh, no, 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 boom. Oh, no, 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 boom. Hey, sweet. Works like a rotary dial thingy. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Oh, Jesus. The worm has died in the creature log. Now he uses use his body as a tunnel. Oh my god! Well, seems we go to safety. Oh wait, this is where I came in. Huh. Okie dokie. So, uh, is this actually like very, like, Metroidvania-esque in the way that it's actually going to like, wander me into a corridor, and then show me the path back out again? Um, am I going, am I, can I get back the way I keep, no I can't, I can't go back that way. Okay. What do I do then? Onward and upward, keep on searching. Keep on searching, baby. Ah! Kill the clams! Kill the clams! <laughs> Exploring the depths with me and my harpoon. Oh yeah, boom! That's exactly what I needed. And now I need more lights. Damn! Ah! Jellyfish aren't affected. In the quiet desolation of the planet Earth, in this new land, covered in water, only the merfolk live. Fuck you! Alright. You're planning to eat me, motherfucker. Uh, so yeah, huge ass chamber! To the surface! <laughs> Out of the water. Ah, oh, shit! The future doesn't look bright. Sooner or later we will die on this planet. All of us, how long do we really expect to survive? Forever? The dinosaurs lasted 65 million years. We'll never make it that long. Press the cross button to close. Upgrade! Oh, my hull's upgraded. That's a good sign. I'm starting in the groove of the actual tunage. I'm liking this.
Adventure, 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 adventure. Well, not to the surface, through the depths! Of exploding fishies. Alright, this just feels so much better now whenever it zooms out. Oh, wait, that was, that's an upgrade crit. Oh. Oh, you suck. You block me from my expensive crit. No! The seaweed forest. Exploding fish! Mast, there were once great forests that covered the surface world. They gave us life and we wiped our asses with them. No! Oh, message! No, we're not fighting against that tide. Not going through that way either. I'm not going that way either. Okay. So the only way is up, baby. For you and me now. You cannot even go up, baby. Just back away now. Fishies! Nothing else I can do here, really? Except for go down. Down, down, going on down. The hull breaking down. Okay, so assuming this actually takes you through multiple locations then. What's the name being this? Oh, right, saving. Okay. Well, I suppose actually that's a good spot for us to stop. Um, if anybody wants to actually see more of this game. In future, then we will actually be able to do so. It sounds like a plan to me. I love the chill out music to this. It's actually, it's just, it's relaxing. It felt so good. I'm just, I'm just zoning out to it. Same as Abzu did it as well. Um, yeah, exploring a world that's actually been completely devoid of humans for a long period of time, finding their messages and notes. It does feel like a bit of a walkathon, but it does have some gameplay elements. I'm curious to find out more and explore more of this little it bit frozen over world. This little ice ball that we've actually impacted ourselves upon after thousands of years of being away. So yeah, thank you very much for watching guys. If you actually enjoyed this, if you enjoy watching this style of video where it's just me playing some games, talking over the top of them, what about me and camera and all the rest of the stuff, feel free to do say so in the comments. I actually don't know what you guys prefer to see, but I can only tell by what you choose to watch and what you choose to tell me about. And make sure to share this all around in any way, shape, or form if you enjoy it yourselves. Now, right, please do remember that actually if you're watching this on YouTube, a few boxes will appear right now. Right at the top of the screen there will be a playlist of some sort. On the far left one corner there should actually be a most recent video on the channel. And down in the bottom left corner there will be a video just for you. Based on your user analytics and things you do on YouTube and all the things that you like to watch, it will pick something that I have made and you may enjoy. Now I also look to the button that's on the other corner saying subscribe. Please do feel free to subscribe if you actually enjoy the content and you would like to see more of it. I like to just say thank you very much everyone for coming to watch and I will see all you dudes in the next video. Bye.